Okay, you all. Today's video, is, I'm going to try to keep it extremely short if possible. Now what I'm focusing on is actually my banana plants, which I have three of them. The one that you see that's contained in this log. And then there are also two back by my boats. And if, I don't know if you notice these long stems, but my tank is going crazy with these lily pads. I'm trying to get it to focus with so much movement. And I know I'm being stupid holding my phone over the water, but I do trust myself to a point. Every banana plant that I have in here is producing these long lily pads. I think that's the coolest thing in the world. And if you look back at it, I'm gonna try to zoom in on it. It's kind of hard. But basically you can see where they're starting to, they've anchored themselves into the ground. And actually the banana part, the, well, it's not really banana, but it looks like it. Um, they're starting to fall off because as it anchors into this, so the uh, rocks, it's lifting into the air and producing all of these lily pads. So my tank is on fleek. <laughs> I'm loving it. It does have a very natural vibe to it. The main thing is I just try to create a natural environment for the fish to feel at home. Nothing too artificial. Keep it natural as possible. He's one of my favorites, by the way. The um, sword tail platy, as you see, he's coming closer. He's very curious as he goes away from me now, probably the vibration. But pretty much wherever I'm at, he does kind of follow me to a certain extent. As you see. That's why I like him. I like his curiosity. But anyhow, like I said, I'm trying to keep this video short. Um, one thing I do want to say, a lot of people say that you should not bury banana plants. Um, and I kind of agree with it, but as you see mine, for whatever reason, are still doing well. As you see that one shoot goes this way, one shoot goes that way. So obviously something is correct. And they are able to still get the nutrients they need in order to set forth the shoot. So this is today's post. I hope everyone enjoyed it. Have a wonderful day. All right, thank you much.